Welcome back, folks, to Farming Simulator 22. We have an interesting day today. I think I have something pretty cool planned for today. We'll see how it turns out. You guys already know by the thumbnail, but anyway, let's go ahead and sell our load here. Our maple syrup is not sold here. I am well aware of that. Okay, and darn, we are making cash. I am actually really thrilled about that. Um, oop. There we go. Let's see if it takes it all now. What are we going to end up? Close to 100. Almost 100,000. So let's go take these maple syrup thingy doodlers to our little tent celly place. Our corn and uh, sunflowers are getting pretty crazy. I think we have probably one more month. Yeah, and then it looks like we can harvest them. So that will be pretty cool but today I have kind of a cool thing planned but we have some stuff to get done before that we have got to uh, we got a oops, let's pull in right here I need to make a better entrance for that um, we we uh, we have to do some seeding and oh there we go we broke our hundred thousand mark I think uh, that's outside of logs I think the first time we've done that actually in fact uh, but we might as well park right here we got some things to do today we got to start off if you can see we can seed uh, wheat and barley and I believe we already planted um, we'll have to look here uh, let's see crop types I'm pretty sure we planted canola yeah, canola is right here. So, we need to put wheat here and barley in the next field for right now. So, let's get started on that. I seeded this and you can barely tell. So, what I'm going to do instead is I'm actually going to go ahead and run the fertilizer first. And that will give me a little bit better of area of where I've been. And where I haven't um, and I'm gonna fertilize both of these two fields I think the other ones we'll leave alone for right now but uh, I'm gonna fertilize these first and then plant the wheat and barley because that's pretty crazy that is a lot better at least I can see where I am going now that is gonna help me out a lot all right wheat is done now we have to do barley in this field right yeah we're gonna do barley in this field right here this should go pretty quick and smooth and as you can see it says needs a uh, weeder and needs rolling uh, now I would love to do rolling but right now the only rollers we have are kind of outside of our power limit here because yeah, 160, 350 horse, 140 horse. And we can see, you know, we bought this planter. Where was it? So like last episode, episode before, you know, a few episodes ago. And this guy is already pushing our tractor to the limit. So I don't really want to push that too much. Um, and obviously right now we can't get a new tractor. We will work on that eventually actually though um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and weed this and um, well at least these two fields and I'm hoping by spring when we do the rest of our planting that we do in fact end up with a larger horsepower tractor to at least do some rolling here that will definitely help us out um, and also help us out with plowing because right now our plow is really kind of hurting us we're only making small fields because of it uh, but we may end up doing an episode two where uh, or maybe another stream like that again where we just take the small plow and make some bigger fields with it you know something fun like that um, but anyway, let's get rolling on to what we got. A lot to do in this episode. 
as you can see, we're doing pretty decent on most of our bales. We're a little bit short on straw and silage. So if we look over here, this whole field is ready to go again here. So I think uh, what we're going to do here is we're going to do a montage bit I, uh, for doing some grass work, in fact. Um, and, or, uh, not grass, well, we're going to do bales. We're going to do silage bales. Uh, so let's get started, folks. Okay, we had a little bit of a bail hiccup there. <laughs> we won't mention that, but anyway, let's go ahead to our next project. This one I'm excited about. Now, this might not be a permanent project, but I want to try it out. There's a mod that has these little buildings uh, that does some uh, kind of production stuff. And if we look at factories here, we have... Uh, fruit we have lettuce and tomatoes and we're just selling it we're not doing anything with it and i want to try these out so let's try this one out uh this might be bad boom all right is that not too crazy all right that looks pretty neat and that's for that. And then we also have this other one here. Uh, I might give a whirl because it's a baker's one. Let's do... Or a potato one. Let's do the... How many potato options do we have? We have white. Let's do a red potato one. Um, let's line these up. 
like so. And you can see it makes some interesting things. Now, one thing that I do know <clears throat> is if we look at cell points. So let's take a look. At the bottom there, you'll see like fries, potato drink. And then for the other one, you'll see... Um, fruit salad and tomato sauce stuff so if we go in here now to our cell points hmm where would that be right here you can see when we get down there um, yeah right here tomato paint sauce uh, Mixed salad, premium potatoes. There's no selling points available for them. So I was looking around a little bit here and I seen uh, the this selling point. Now, there is two selling points that actually work. Um, but I think... Uh, whoop, where is this? I think this is the one... And I think for right now, we're just going to put this guy right here for the time being. Um, and these eventually will be part of town. And actually, I replaced it. I just realized we could probably put that thing by our other stall way out here. What what, what we got out here? I forget. Um, oh, maple syrup. Yeah, we could have done that probably too. But for right now... We just want to see how these guys function in the world really quick. Let's do a few things. Let's landscape. Uh, let's see. With Let's do... I believe that looks like asphalt there, don't it? There we go. And we'll come up here like so. And we will do our normal got to get it back thing. Let's, so let's do gravel. Seems like the grass has a weirder hitbox than everything else. So let's just do this for now. And then let's do a smaller one. Kind of make it mix it in, make it look nice. And then let's take a gander. Hopefully I didn't um, mess this up real bad. So we're going to see here. So this one is our fruits building, or, or not fruits, well, we'll call it vegetables. And we could do either tomato, or we could do mixed salad. I think we're going to do mixed salad, all right? So for that guy, um, we're going to need... Our, you know, let's see here. We'll need lettuce and tomatoes. So I did have the lettuce ready. But I don't think we have any tomatoes. Let's go ahead. Do they unload? Well, okay, they do. Good. So how full is that getting? Boy, that is really... It needs a lot, don't it? Uh, let's see. I don't think we have any tomatoes. Uh, I believe them are strawberries right here. Let's see. I think these are strawberries. Yeah. So, one thing we do know with these guys here, um, we know that they produce... Let's go up. Let's go up to our thingy doodlers. Oh, way up. There we go. So we know that that this makes not much <laughs> not much lettuce in comparison to what it does tomatoes. Tomatoes is one to one. Lettuce is one to one or two to one. So it does half the lettuce as it does tomatoes. Um, that being said, I think what we're going to do, because it needs one of each, 
to try to keep the lettuce up to the tomato production. Ooh, this is this is sketchy at best. I think we're gonna try. Um, let's go in here. Let's go ahead. Let's get rid of this greenhouse. All right, we got rid of that one. And let's try to put in greenhouse. There's this new one, hydroponics. And what are you overlapping with? Ooh, that's, that's not good. Oh, there we go. All right, so it looks like we have to go over here. How far over can we get it? All right, like so. Oh, I did not place that right, did I? I just realized how off that was. Please. Let me demolish you for 10. Yeah, we can. <laughs> All right, let's place this right now. I was so worried about where we could put it that I wasn't looking side to side, actually. So right there, let's get lined up. Because I kind of want these to look good. And that actually helps. That gives me a little bit more space. Now, is that better? Oh, that's so much better. Okay, that gives me a little bit of space in here to get the water in for this guy. I'm not actually mad about this. This really doesn't block anything over here, so I feel pretty good about that. So, I know we're waiting on that last production over there, but let's take a look at this guy. Lettuce, tomato, oh, and we need, is that liquid fertilizer? Oh, all right. I get your game. And we're going to need lettuce there. And it says it's missing material. So let me go ahead. Uh, we should take the truck up and get some liquid fertilizer. How much does the, I wonder how much that would hold. Hmm. Let's get a fair bit of it. Hey, Float. Just here to get some liquid fertilizer. Apparently, people have a problem with me pooping in my greenhouses. There we go. Right there. Let's grab maybe two of them. Three of them. Maybe four of them. What I said there. This is really cool looking. So, I put water in it. And you can see it says water to 20,000. But... Oh, wait, I was going to say, it only looks like 12,000 right there. I bet you I was looking at the wrong one. I'm, uh, I'm not, I'm laughing. I, I might, uh, I might edit that out of the video. <laughs> what am I saying? I won't. I'm too lazy to edit it out of the video. <laughs> All right, so curiosity has got the best of me, and I want to see if I can load Let's go slow. Let's not want to pick these up off the ground. Just out of curiosity. Let's see if these pick up from right here. Um, looks like no. Right? None of them are... Alright, um... Let's grab silver and just see. I don't know where we put the fertilizer. <gasps> oh, I, is it over here? Maybe it's over there. Let's just check really quick. I'm thinking maybe that's why it overlapped, is you have to put the fertilizer in over on that side. All right, I do have liquid fertilizer, so are you going in? You are not. So, safe to assume you are an over there issue. All right, 
let's just see. I don't know how to put the liquid fertilizer in. Materials missing. How? Hmm. Let me figure this out. I have a sneaking suspicion. I feel I like I know what it is. Maybe. We'll see. Maybe I have to take that fertilizer and put it into a trailer and unload it that way. Alright, so we're only going to do one because otherwise I have a trailer full of liquid fertilizer that I don't know how to get rid of. <laughs> so let's do this. I bet ya. Yep, that's what it was. And it looks like... I don't know how much it can hold. I kind of don't want to... You know what? Let's actually... Maybe we can. Can it come out as fast as it's going in? That's hilarious. Alright, so that is, so it is full on fertilizer. Can we, uh oh. I don't think we can unload this. That's a little while, I was a little bit worried. Hmm. Now, for the potato thingy doodler of justice, uh, what are we gonna do? French fries? And it makes us two pig food. Hmm. Actually, this could produce pig food for us, but I don't want to do that. Uh, we could. Hmm. So let's see what is worth more potatoes. Or premium potatoes? French fries or premium potatoes? French fries or premium potatoes? Premium potatoes are worth more. Huh. Really? Oh, and we need water. So... I have to figure out what I'm going to do with that liquid fertilizer that is in that dealio. Hmm. Let's grab, first of all, before I figure that out, let's go over here, and I think I can take these, this, right over to, I think I can unload it into here. Let's hope so. Okay, so we can. How many potatoes is it? Oh, wow, that thing needs a lot of potatoes. Um, let's actually go ahead and I think we're going to hook up the trailer. This will be the first time we get to see this. Really, we've never really moved much of our stuff before. Um, let's go around back. And let's fill up quick. Wait, is that not where we fill up? There we go. Yeah, and then we're going to fill up, and I'm going to see if that all works like I think it does. And then bring you back. Yep, this part works like it should. You know, that actually kind of works out because uh, having that liquid fertilizer stuck in that one 
And that is a green trailer that we do have. Maybe we get a blue one that we use for water and milk. And that one's like our fertilizer and herbicide and anything else that it can hold tank. Like this will be the edible tank and the other one will be the inedible tank. Um, actually, I think that'll work pretty good. And we have two separate tanks uh, and that'll help us out quite a bit. No, no, that's completely realistic that this building holds seven friggin' million trailer loads of this. That's, all right, this is my sixth trailer load, and that's not even going to put it to half. So it could, it could, this building apparently is like a god, and it can fit 30,000 million loads. Jeepers. I'm actually assuming it's somewhere around that 200,000 mark. Dang, that's nuts. I just brought one tank over, and that's how full it filled it. <laughs> this is going to take a while to fill that water tank. Ah, uh, but at least we have it rocking and rolling. And I think one more thing we're going to add, just for poops and giggles, is going to be... Um, over here so our new buildings can get Wi-Fi and <laughs> cell phone reception. We're going to put one of these cell phone towers right, oh, not there. Oh, you know what? Oh, man, I wanted, this actually looks way cooler than I thought it would. Maybe we put it... Hmm. Now I kind of want it at the beginning of the barn because it looks cool. Yeah, that's... I like that. That looks pretty good. Well, is there anything we could put over here now? I don't, I don't really have a whole lot I want to throw at it. Small solar collector? Oh. Um, you know, that would be kind of cool, but we should put that, where should we put that? I, I wanted to put it over here, but honestly, it doesn't really fit. Oh, you, you know what? We'll put it over here so they have power out here. <laughs> I, I'm so dumb. I don't care. I like the little stuff. We're going to start getting into details. Actually, that'll too will take a little bit of edge off the construction cost. So, as you can see, I have three hours of filling the dang potato thing. So, we'll see you in the next episode, folks.